airport, we're headed to Florida for a two year anniversary trip. We'll be in Florida for four days. We both are taking a carry on and a backpack, and then I have my um, funny looking fanny pack along. I think it's very, very handy. It doesn't look necessarily amazing, but I don't care. Um, anyway, so we have another how long to the airport? 35 minutes. 35 minutes, so it's not long yet. Um, and then we will fly to Punta Gorda and then we will get a rental car and then um, head to our Airbnb, which is right next to Siesta Key. So we are so excited to have a vacation and just hang out and not have any responsibilities or stress or anything. Anyway, so do you have anything you want to add? find food because we are very very hungry um we decided Popeyes because <laughs> we've never I've never been there have you been there nope I've never been there either I think they have chicken we just saw a car towing a truck yesterday our travel day a little yes. bit yes so we got up yesterday morning at like what 7 38 something like that yeah and then went to a pancake fundraiser for gosh fire department was putting on a pancake yeah. sausage fundraiser so, so it was so that. good it was amazing we went with, his parents were there too. His dad's also in the fire department and his uncle. So they were all there too. Um, so that was fun. And then. Went home and packed. Yes. And even, I mean, she had packed like a week ago. <laughs> I packed like four days ago. So I was so excited. Oh, um, but to pack he didn't have as much time to pack before the, the travel day. So. Yeah. So we went home and packed. Yep. And then we were planning to leave at noon. We left at quarter after. But it was fine. Yeah. It all it was fine. We were an hour to the airport, and our flight left at four. Yeah. So. Four. Oh, seven or something like that. So we didn't have any check-ins. So that was nice. We walked yes. to the airport right through security. That was so nice. It's amazing. If we can avoid check-ins for the rest of our life, let's do it. <laughs> Because that was amazing. Yeah. Um, so the flight was interesting. We tried something new. We decided to sit in the front because we both have long legs. And he has way longer legs than me. And so it feels like claustrophobic sometimes sitting on the planes, like being all crammed in. Um, especially for him. So we decided to sit in the front of the plane. It, it was just an exit row seat. Yeah, it wasn't first class or anything. It was just the front of the plane. But turns out, I don't know why I didn't think of this, but it turns out you can't have your backpacks with you because there's no seat in front of you to put the backpack under. So the first part of the flight and right at the end, we're just like staring at the, not staring at, it was, it was a little awkward, I guess, trying not to look at the um, 
flight attendants because they're like sitting right in front of you on those little flip out chairs. But they were really funny. Yeah. Um, there was a guy next to us who was having fun chatting with them, very extroverted. Um, anyway, so the flight went well. It went fast. Yeah, it went it was fast. Like two hours and ten minutes, but it went quick. Yeah, I was watching NCIS, <laughs> and he was playing a game. <laughs> but yeah, it was kind of frustrating not being able to have our backpacks because his phone was almost dead towards the end and we didn't have our little charging port things because they were up in the bins and that was a little frustrating um so i don't know that we would do that again the leg room was nice but not having any of your stuff and you don't have a tray or yeah. anything it's not for a well, two-hour flight it's not bad but yeah i don't know that i would do it again it wasn't really worth 30 bucks extra per person for, to not have yeah. I love the extra leg room, but, and it was fascinating seeing all the stuff the flight attendants did, like how they did stuff, hearing them talk to each other, like about when they're going to do the announcements and like that. That was fascinating, mm -hmm. but it was also a little awkward because they were like right in front of us, um, facing us. Anyway, so that was the flight. And when did we land? We landed earlier than it had said. We landed at like 6... It had said we would land at 6.36. Right? Something like that. 6.37, yeah. something like that. But we landed earlier. Mm -hmm. 6.15? Something like that. The best part about sitting up front, we had to get out of the plane immediately. We were the first ones out of the plane, which was like so nice. And again, and we didn't have carry-ons, so yes. there was no baggage claim. No, we didn't have check-ins. Or check-ins. So yeah. we didn't have to go to baggage claim. Yes! That was just so awesome because we were both starving hungry. Thankfully, we had taken sandwiches for, like, lunchtime on the ride to the airport earlier. So we we had lunch, but we were so... We were famished by the time we got off the plane. Mm -hmm. So we landed. No baggage claim. And in Punta Gorda, the rental car place is right beside the airport. So we went over, had no problems getting our car, which was amazing because never had that happen before. It was like the fastest process. She was so helpful. Mm -hmm. and Yeah, so we got our car and headed for Popeye's. Mm-hmm. And... Because neither of us had ever been there. Nope. And it's very much like Kentucky Fried Chicken. Mm -hmm. Kentucky Fried Chicken? Yeah. KFC? Yes. It's very much like that, but it's different. They do their chicken differently. Mm-hmm. It was good. I think I prefer KFC, but yeah. yes, it was good. Popeyes is good. Yeah. Then we had a 45 minute drive from there to mm -hmm. our condo that we're staying at. But before that. Before that. What do we do? We went shopping? I don't know. Oh, yeah, we went to Walmart and got <laughs> groceries. How long were we in Walmart? 45 minutes? Are you serious? That was long. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I didn't we realize we were in there that long. Got a bunch of stuff for breakfast and lunch, some lunch and some um, pizza for supper one night. Mm -hmm. Pop like popable popcorn, microwavable popcorn and chips. Bottled water. And bottled water and coffee. I messaged the Airbnb lady and she said that she has a coffee maker, but she does not supply coffee grounds. So we got some Starbucks coffee grounds and. All sorts of stuff. Yeah, so fruit, now, some veggies, just stuff to have here so we don't always have to like go out to eat or whatever. Because yeah. we're right by the beach. Yep. So we're about to go check that out. <laughs> um this morning we were just super lazy. Got up really late. Drank coffee. Ooh, I wanna talk about our journal a little bit. Okay. We have what's called a promptly journal i know i mentioned it in the um packing video but we love it right do we mm -hmm. love it yes, yes we love it it's so cool so it like gives you prompts for like your courtship stage and then your engagement stage and your wedding day and your first anniversary and your second anniversary all the way up to i don't know how many anniversaries like a lot mm -hmm. um and you can put pictures in there, and you can write notes to each other in there, and you can just kind of record your journey, your relationship. It is so cool. 
they um, have a whole bunch of different journals. They have journals for, like, um, your first child, your second child, where you can, like, stage all like all the stages and when they said their first word and all that stuff. So they have tons of different kinds of journals, and I love it. Like, I think it was worth it. It was really cool. Mm -hmm. It even had, like, a place for, like, the guests to sign, so we used it as our guest book at our wedding. So that's cool. Anyway... Today, what are we going to do today? Go to the beach. Yes, go to the beach. There's a pool right here. We didn't realize the condo was this big. There's, like, a lot of apartments. I mean, we knew it was big, but we didn't realize there was going to be this many. Yeah. Like, there's yeah. 80 condos yeah. in this little area. Lots of apartments. Yeah. They have, like, a... Is it a shuffleboard out here? Not Grills, really. picnic tables, pool. The pool is, like, eight foot... There's two pools. There's two pools? Mm -hmm. There's I one on either end. I didn't know there was two pools. That's yep. cool. Right now, there's like a dad and his kiddos out there in the pool. We can kind of hear them a little bit. Um, so we'll probably get in the pool later. It's supposed to get up to 82 today, so that's cool. Um, yeah, so here soon we're going to go out to the beach and probably get some footage. So. Yeah. Disappeared within like ten minutes max. We got 
three more nights. Yeah. So. We'll get we'll get his look. It's gorgeous out here. Yeah.